Hello and welcome. We're going to solve this problem together. First, um, I would just pause this video and you might even get some graph paper and set this graph up. You might write these equations out and then I'll point the question out there asking which ordered pair is the solution to the system of equations. So you can solve this in a lot of ways. You might pause the video and get started on that. All right, so let's read the question together. It says, the population growth of two towns over a period of five years is represented by the system of equations below, both algebraically, so here's our system, algebraically, system, of course, is a collection of equations, and here's the graphical representation. So we have the algebra, and we have the graph. And they want to know what order pairs the solution to the system of equations. Well, I can see it right away. They're giving us a graph, and if you're given a graph, it's possible that it's just really easy to solve it because what you could do is simply look at the intersection of the two lines you're given here. These two lines are only going to cross once, right? If two lines cross like this with different slopes, they're only going to cross one time. It's never going to happen again. And when they do cross, that is the solution of both lines. Think about it, right? At this point right here, it's the point 410. At that point, and at no other, these two lines have the same exact value. So at that point, they're equal. And that simply means at four years, they both had a population of 10,000. So our choices here, we can see there, listen to point 410. And that is the solution. I'm not going to, go to get into it right now, but we can use algebra to solve this as well. You might try subtracting one equation from the other to solve for x. And then you'll get 4 when you do that. And then plug the value of x back in to find y, and you will get 10. So you can try that if you want. Give it a shot. Subtract that second equation from the first and see what happens. All right, thanks. Hope this helped.